Hey, how's it going? Well, if it isn't Master Asahi, something I can help you with? Oh, no, we're just here on a quest of sorts. I'm trying to introduce Katomi here to some new speech styles. So, Ko, when Nana here gets startled, she... Uh, she's real. I swear she is. I guess she up and left you, huh? Hey, Ko! Jeez, Ko, hold your horses. Seriously, why not try talking like Nana? It's subtle, easy to adapt to. No, 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 not on your life. I'll kill you. Ah. <sighs> it's hopeless. Blunt and mean is all you know. I told you right from the start, every other speech style is the worst. Particularly that pervy pink puffs. Yeah? Are styles like that supposed to add character or something? It's stupid. It just attaches you to an archetype. I don't know. I feel like your style of speech pretty well attaches you to an archetype, too. I'm not an archetype. I beg to differ. But either way, if not for archetype classification, then why do you talk the way you do? I don't know. I've never thought about it. Not even once. The mistress can't help but speak the way she does. It's simply who she is. Yoshino? Hey, Yoshino. Quick question. Has Ko always been like this? She has indeed. Do you think maybe, just maybe, it's because you've been spoiling... Asahi? You wouldn't by any chance be complaining about me to my maid, would you? Oh, no. Perish the thought. Oh, my. Jeez, Yoshino, don't laugh. My apologies. It's just that, as I said, the mistress is who she is. And this exchange between you two only proves it. What do you mean? Allow your mind to wander for a moment. Imagine what it would be like if... Well... Master, I am at your beck and call. Whatever you wish, it will be my command. <laughs> I am Master Katomi, the cold-hearted poisonous doll, unequaled in this world, and you are a dingus! Yeah? Is something the matter? Perhaps you'd like to be cured limb from limb! Now that you mention it, those are all simply terrible ideas. Oh my, yes. You finally understand. What the heck are you two talking about? Sorry about all this, Ko. I was wrong to try and change you. You're fine just the way you are. Huh?
are delusions. Huh. No DAB agents this time. Now what's going on? Better not look a gift horse in the mouth. Let's get in there while we have the chance. Don't let your guard down, Yamato. We've got to be very careful here. Shall we purchase trading cards? When saving, do be careful not to overwrite a sibling's data. It's a door. Shall we open it? If you're to go through this door, please be... Quite the crowd, no? No problem. This should be an easy clean. Let us strive to make the It's a door. Shall we open it? If you're to go through this door, please be... It's a safe point. Shall we make use of it before moving on? If you're to go through this door, please be certain you're ready. This shop sells all kinds of odds and ends. Shop. Wait, somebody's here. Correct. The target's whereabouts are still unknown. Quiet. It's a DAB agent. Who's he talking to? Neither the two girls nor the delusion contractor appear to be present within. How are things on your end? Who is he talking to? Sounds like two agents exchanging reports to me. So no luck in the electronics one either? Very well. Only one place left for us to search. Understood. We'll meet up after. Until then. Let's slip out before we're seen.
Those agents are definitely on the lookout for Saki and Akari. And Canon, of course. It sounds like they've already